Researching families in New York State can be challenging for many reasons, and we're here to help you meet that challenge head on. The more you know about New York State records, record keeping practices, and locations, the more discoveries you'll be able to make. Our New York Knowledge Base and Webinar Library are the perfect places to gain the knowledge you need to become an absolute New York expert. Only NYGNB members can access the hundreds of articles in the New York Knowledge Base and the dozens of webinars in our webinar library. The Knowledge Base contains in-depth guides and articles to many aspects of New York State research, and each one is authored by a subject expert. Some of the general topics include advice for researching in different time periods throughout New York history, guidance on using different types of records and the specifics of using those records for New York State research, methodology articles, which will help you brush up on your general genealogy skills, whether you're a beginner, expert, or anywhere in between, guides to researching the variety of prevalent ethnic groups and communities throughout New York State, articles about specific counties and locations that list online records and brick and mortar repositories for research, and guides to many of the key brick and mortar repositories themselves in New York State. Our webinar library contains all of our recorded webinars and live presentations covering similar subjects to our New York knowledge base. We're constantly bringing in the top genealogy experts to present webinars on a wide variety of topics. Although the live broadcasts are typically open to the public, only NYGNB members can watch recordings. This way you'll never have to worry about missing one of our live webinars again. Both areas can be found in the Tools and Resources section. Just hover your mouse over that item on the main navigation menu from any page on our site. Let's look at the Knowledge Base first. The first thing you'll see is our featured article, which changes regularly. Below that, you'll see a link to a list of county guides. Each of these guides contain detailed information about that county, as well as an amazing list of resources for researching in that county. To read articles in the Knowledge Base and watch webinars, you will need to log in using your NYGNB username and password. As you can see, there are many, many resources available in the guide for each county. These guides are great places to start if your research has brought you to focus on a specific county in New York. It's also a good idea to turn to a county guide if you have researched frequently in a county and are looking for even more records. Heading back to the Knowledge Base homepage, let's take a look at some ways to browse other articles in the Knowledge Base. You can click the middle box here to see a full list of Knowledge Base articles. Further down the page, you can also search the text of all Knowledge Base articles or browse by subject or location. Let's take a look at all Knowledge Base articles about cemetery records. Here, we're looking at a list of all Knowledge Base articles related to this subject. Click the title to view the full article. You can also adjust the filters to look for different subjects. If you would like to see all articles, select any. You can also filter articles based on location. One important note, if an article is dedicated to primarily to a single county in New York State, we have tagged that article with that county specifically. However, if the article applies to all or the majority of counties in New York State, then we have simply tagged that article with New York State. So make sure not to forget to check for New York State articles if you're browsing by location. Here's a great example of a knowledge base article. This one is about an important but underutilized collection at the New York Public Library. As you can see, it's very long and in-depth, the perfect resource if you're looking to use or learn more about this fantastic collection. A few things I want to point out here at the top of this article. This Add to Favorites button on the right side will add this article to a list of favorites that appear in your member dashboard. You can also click any of these tags below the title to see more content related to that term. You can click on the author's name to see more articles written by that author, or you can click on the subject tag, in this case military and the NYPL, to see more articles about that subject. 
Note that when you click on these tags, you'll see all website content related to that subject, blogs, webinars, and knowledge base articles. It's a great way to explore the site and see what there is on your favorite subject. Going back to the knowledge base article, you'll also see a list of content that is related by subject and location on the left-hand side of the article. This is another great way to see what related content is also on our website. Let's take a look at our webinar library, which can be found right underneath the knowledge base in the main menu. The webinar library contains a similar interface to the knowledge base. The most recent webinars appear at the top, but you can also browse by subject and location. Click on the webinar title to see the presentation and the handout. There will be a short description of the lecture, a link to download the handout, and then a video to play when you're ready to begin the presentation. Again, you will see the same listing of related content on the left side of the screen, so don't forget to take a look to see what else is there related to this subject. And that concludes this brief overview of these tools. I encourage you to go out and explore both sections of our website. There are some really interesting webinars and knowledge base articles, and many of these resources will prove essential to discovering more of your New York ancestors.